Argentina's Vice President Cristina Kirchner, familiar to the UK government for her hardline stance on the Falkland Islands, wields more power than Alberto Fernandez, the country's leader, and harbors ambitions of a turn to the top job, it has been claimed. Mrs. Kirchner served two terms as the country's president, from 2007 to 2011, and 2011 to 2015, having succeeded her husband, Nestor Kirchner, Argentina's president from 2003 to 2007. A Peronist with a left-wing agenda, Mrs. Kirchner has made no secret of her belief that the Falkland Islands, which Argentina refers to as the Malvinas, rightfully belong to her country. In 2012 she proclaimed, I am a Malvinist president. It is an injustice that a colonialist enclave still exists a few hundred kilometers from our shores in the 21st century. It is absurd to pretend Dominion 8,000 miles overseas. A source with knowledge of the situation told Express it was entirely reasonable to conclude that Mrs. Kirchner was probably more powerful than Mr. Fernandez, who was elected, with her at his side, last year. The source added, it's true that she and her branch of the Peronist movement are particularly hard line over the Falklands issue too. The governor of the province of Tierra del Fuego, Gustavo Malela, is also a Kirchnerist, and very hard line over the Falklands, and in Tierra del Fuego they claim the absurdity that the Falklands are part of their province. Considering the reasons why Mrs. Kirchner, whose husband died in 2010, and whose son Maximo is also a member of the Argentinian Congress, remained so influential, the source explained, unlike most vice presidents she brought a huge number of votes to their joint campaign in the presidential elections. So she was always going to be influential. And it's no secret that she would like to be president again, and she will be if Fernandez gives up. But I think people are surprised at the way she has already become so powerful.